Hey y'all, hope everybody's doing well on this wonderful Thursday afternoon. Um, I want to show y'all some more pictures, okay? In the same hallway that I've been focusing on for a little while now. Um, since my, let's see, okay. Those of you that have watched the last uh, the last two videos that I've done, okay, I have talked to y'all about like different perceptions, okay, you know, different perceptions on how you view things, all right. Um, what they have done with this footage, okay, like I've tried to explain so many times, they have blended people together okay it's multiple people that's walking around and they've blended it and they have put this image of you know they've made this image of Kanika over these people okay the thing is and I and I go over this again because there's always people that are there's always new new viewers okay new watchers people that are just hearing about Kanika Jenkins okay the thing is, you have to look at these pictures with a different view, okay? You can't look at it like like you're looking around your house or like how you look in the mirror. Like, you cannot look at these like a picture that's sitting on your, on your coffee table or end table or whatever. You can't. This is not your average situation, okay? This is something that is, it's like, it's like a hidden picture, okay? Has anybody ever, have y'all ever looked at Highlights magazines? Um, I know when I was a kid, okay, I used to love Highlights magazines, all right? And I used to love looking at, looking for the hidden pictures and... Sometimes they would have like um, these illusions in there, okay? And if you've ever been to like Ripley's, believe it or not, or something like that, like you know what I'm talking about. And they're, they even put them on Facebook sometimes. It's like these it's an optical illusion. It'll look like it'll look like one thing, but the picture is really something else, okay? It can be made to look like something else than what it is but it's actually one thing okay uh, let me see if i can actually pull something up just to give you an example of what i'm talking about okay um one second okay <clears throat> so here's one okay this isn't really a good one but this is one okay this is supposed to it's supposed to be a young lady or an old lady all right if you like when i first looked at it i saw a woman uh, like a young girl, she has her fa her head turned over her right shoulder, and she has like a little feather hat on, okay? But if you look at it with a different view, it could also be an old woman who, like, you can see her, this is the front of her, looks like her bangs, okay? She has like a covering maybe over her hair, um, you know, like a hat or something, okay? Here's her nose, and then her mouth goes in, and then this is her chin. These are her eyes. You know what I'm saying? Like her, her ear, the old, the young woman's ear is the old lady's eye. Okay, the young woman's chin and jawbone is the old lady's nose. Y'all see that? Okay, that is how things can look different. Okay, um, and that's sort of what that's what they have created basically with the surveillance footage of Kanika Jenkins, okay? 90, about 95% of us know that this is not Kanika walking down the hallway. There's still people that are following Kanika's case three years later, and they still believe that, they, yeah, they believe that something happened to Kanika, but they still believe that this is her roaming the hallways, and... Y'all, this is not her roam in the hallway. Like, this is multiple people. Um, you know, I just don't, 
I don't know what all we have to do to, to show this. I mean, this is, this is definitely not her. Okay. She's there, but it's just not her walking around and stumbling around. Okay. Before I get into the pictures that I want to show y'all. All right. On this video right here. And this video right here that I did. Let me go down a little bit just so y'all can see in case you have not seen the video. The first one that I did was called, is called, Who is this walking with Kanika? The second one I did that I'm talking about is very clear picture of the person with Kanika in the hallway. Okay, now these two videos right here, I had a lot of feedback saying, yeah, it looks like two people walking side by side with someone in the middle. Looks like maybe they have Kanika in between them. Okay. If y'all sent me an email, if, if anybody has emailed me <clears throat> and I haven't responded back, don't think that I'm ignoring you. Okay. It's not that I am ignoring you. I might not know how to respond to it at that point, at that point in time, okay? Um, the thing is, sometimes y'all send me things, and I don't see it at first, okay? And that's why I don't really know what to say. So, I, don't, I might not really know how to, you know, respond to it, because I might not see it at first. But then after digging around a little bit, it might pop up on me, okay? And that's sort of the case of what happened this time okay like i said i had a lot of feedback i had emails i had comments down below saying yeah it looks like it looks like two people walking close together with someone in the middle between them okay i never saw it i see it now um someone even sent me a picture the other day let's see and showed this, okay, right here, and said, yeah, see, it looks like Kanika's in the middle, okay, or it looks like I see Kanika's face, or whatever, okay, y'all, because see, in this video right here, for those of you that haven't seen it, I showed where, and, and you need to go back and look at it, okay, because it will explain to you how... You need to go look at the look at the last three videos that I've done if you don't understand the one that I'm about to show you, okay? Or if you feel lost, go look at those. Um, I explain how you can see the line right here that divides people. You can see the two different faces right here. You can you can see a lot, okay? And you can also see that it looks very strange. That just a lot doesn't look right, okay? Um. You know, and someone even sent me a picture and circled her foot back here, you know, which there's another picture on this particular video that I'm talking about. The one that says, who is this walking with Kanika? Um, when they get a little farther up like this, the foot, you can just tell it does not belong to the people that are walking. Okay, it looks like it's being drugged on the floor um, behind them. Okay, behind what is supposed to be Kanika walking, there is a foot back there dragging and it's supposed to look like that's her foot walking but that's not her foot walking that's her foot being drug on the floor okay now now i'm gonna get into this oh let me just tell y'all real quick okay because i also had multiple people saying that that they saw and this is a picture that someone sent me and circled okay so i'm using this but I've had multiple people emailing me about, and even probably even writing in the comments under this video right here, oh, there's people in the background, there's people back here, there's someone up against the door, there's, am I tripping, and all this stuff. Let me tell y'all, if y'all see this, no, you're not tripping, like, you're, you're seeing correctly, there are people back here, okay, um, I didn't, I didn't discuss it in this particular video, because I didn't want to take away from what I was trying to explain about Kanika being pushed in that bathroom, okay? Um, the thing is, there are definitely people back here. I did pictures 
on this a long time ago, on this whole area, okay? Yes, this back here, I always said this right here looks like Monifa sitting back here. I always saw her back here smiling, grinning. She is sitting here watching her friend, okay? Um, the thing is, y'all, and I said it before, Candace Starr did a video a long time ago. Okay, I'm about to hurry up. I'm going to get on these um, pictures in just a second. Just give me a minute. Candace Starr did a video a long time ago. I have looked for it and looked for it and looked for it over the years. I could not find it. Um, and I don't, I think she might have deleted a lot of her videos. I'm not sure. Okay, I don't know. Um, but, okay, when she did this video, you can see a whole lot. You can see people over here. You can see people over here lined up against the wall on the stairs. You can see it all. Okay. Um, if I find that video, I am going to let y'all know where it's at so y'all can go look at it because it really, really shows a lot. And, you know, I, I hope I can find it, you know, and if she... If she's listening or, you know, maybe if y'all can tell her or something to contact me, there is a video and I don't, she didn't talk about it in the video. It's like she, maybe she overlooked, maybe she overlooked that. You know, like I said, a lot of times we overlook things because we're focusing on what it is that we see at that point in time. And sometimes we don't see everything else that's going on. You know, we, we miss it. Um... And that's just how, that's how it is, okay? But if, you know, if y'all can please tell her to get a hold of me or whatever, my email's down below. I would be interested in, um, you know, maybe her going back over that video or something. Because there's a lot on there that, that I saw. Like, I don't know. I don't know. I saw a whole lot. I saw everybody there, okay, from the party. Um, okay, anyway, so getting back into... Getting back into this, okay, I wanted to show y'all some pictures, all right? Like I said, I've been working on this particular hallway, as you can see, okay, the hallway that leads into the kitchen with the stairway, all right, that leads up to the flight deck, okay? So we're on the lower level floor in a hall, all right? Now, I want to show y'all some pictures that I came across, well, that I've got, okay, and let's see, let me pull this one up, okay, as I was doing it, like I said, I, I keep seeing two people, I keep seeing like two to three people blended together, they're walking very closely, um, but in the ones that I did, y'all, Yesterday, well, I, I don't know if it was yesterday or the day before. Like I said, sometimes when I do these, y'all, I feel the same way. It takes me, sometimes it takes me a while to to put them out and to even go over them with y'all. Because I start, I start doubting myself. I start doubting my own eyes. You know what I'm saying? I feel like, am I tripping? You know, am I really seeing this? You know, is this real? I ask myself the same questions. So, it's okay if you feel like, you know, like, like what you're seeing really ain't real, okay? Because we all have had, we all feel like that when we first see something like this. We're like, what? You know, is this real? Am I tripping? Like, there's no way. There's no way, okay? So, I'm just going to show y'all the original um, screenshots that I took, okay, so let's see, these are the screenshots that I took, and, hold on, let me just get a little, move it a little bit, okay, here we'll just zoom in, just so you can see, I haven't done anything to these, these are just a screenshot, okay, let me make this, there we go. Okay. Okay, so it's just a screenshot, okay? That's all. Alright, so this is supposed to be Kanika. 
walking down the hallway, okay? She's walking back towards the camera, and at this point, she's about to enter the kitchen, okay? So she's already gone into the bathroom and gone around the corner and all of that. Now, this is after she comes out from around the corner and before she enters the kitchen, okay? So let me go to the next picture. Okay, so now all these are in sequence, okay? The ones that I'm showing y'all right now, they're all in sequence. Um, there's that. Okay. And I know some of y'all probably already see what I'm about to point out. And I have, like I said, these are just screenshots, okay? I have not done anything at all to this. I haven't put it through software. I haven't lightened it up. I haven't done crap to it. This is strictly a screenshot from surveillance footage from Rosemont, okay? So, like I keep saying, every single thing that happened to her, it's right in front of our faces, y'all. We have literally been looking at this for the last three years, okay? So, I know a lot of y'all are thinking, oh, wow, you know, what happened? Oh, we'll never find out. No, we're going to find out because we have the answers. We have everything that went down in that hotel. We have available to us. It's just a matter of doing what you need to do to find out the answers, okay? Believe me, it's not going to just pop out of the blue one day and say, here I am. You got to look for it. You got to work for it. You got to find it. Okay. Uh, wow. Okay. I'm, I'm about to show y'all in just a minute. I'm just showing you the original screenshots. Okay. That I took real quick. I'm about to show y'all. There are two people from what I see Two could be more. Okay. But what I see right here is two people carrying Kanika, okay? So, all right, okay? So, let me show y'all this. Let's see. All right, so, okay, when I was taking these screenshots, I just, I knew a lot did not look right, okay? And that's why I take the screenshots because it does not look right so there's something there all right i'm gonna show y'all what's there and how it's two people oh, let me see which one this is <laughs> okay Let's see maybe i should do You know what? Let's do let's do this first. Here, I'm gonna show y'all. Okay, the first software that I put these pictures through. Okay. Y'all, it looks like okay, like I said, they're walking towards us. Okay, in the last video I did, I know some people were getting confused. They were actually walking in the in the they were walking towards the stairway. Okay. In this video right now that we're doing. They're walking towards us. Kanika is supposed to be facing us, okay? This is actually supposed to be Kanika's face right here, okay? This right here is supposed to be Kanika's face, all right? Does that look like a face to y'all? No. Mm-mm. Not to me either. Um, wow. Y'all, you can see where somebody is right here. You can literally see... Hold on, let me go down a little bit. You can see someone right here, okay? You can even see how the legs are different. Um, let me do this. Okay. I'm just going to put this over that, over the over the head, okay, or over the face, okay? I'm just going to put this, put this square right here, all right? And I'm going to do this with all three pictures I'm going to show y'all, okay? And what I just suggest if you don't see it if you don't see it what you need to do is 
move your device back okay I don't know what you're on if you're on a phone if you're on a phone set your phone down and step back away from it if you're on a computer laptop whatever scoot your chair back you know set your set your device down and step back for a minute okay because I'm about to help you see this in a completely different perspective okay um it looks like there's two people facing each other okay it also looks to me like there's someone in the middle of them it looks like they're carrying someone in the middle in between them um, and it's not just carrying someone it looks to me like they're holding the person like this okay like they're holding the like they're holding the person like this okay um all right that's exactly what I see um my god let's see we didn't do those yet I have another software I'm gonna show y'all cuz I actually kind of brightened the I brightened up the pictures that I'm showing y'all now okay I'm just showing y'all the ones that I put through the first um, software okay let me show y'all this one let's see this is another another one okay I'm gonna do the same thing with this okay I'm gonna put this bar over over that and I'm gonna outline for y'all in just a minute okay cuz I know some people you know it's a little easier sometimes when you have an outline um, of it you know to explain what it is that you're seeing and I'm gonna show y'all that in just a second so just y'all please just bear with me okay because this is a lot um, what the heck just happened hmm yeah, that's weird anyways okay like I said if you can't see it okay step back away from the computer um I'm actually gonna give you a second okay close your eyes we'll we'll just wait like five or ten seconds okay if you can't see it close your eyes or get up get up walk away and come back Okay, I'm just going to give you a second. Okay, so do y'all see that? It looks like people are facing each other. Okay, it looks to me like there may be chest to chest. Okay, like I said, I'm going to outline it in just a minute. But right here, if you look right here, okay. You can sort of you can see where that's somebody's face you can see a, a face right here yes yeah, a little blurred out but you can still tell that it's a face you know what I'm saying like you can see the side or back or whatever of the person's head okay so hold on let me show y'all the third picture and then then I'm gonna do some outlining for y'all okay but I'm gonna go to the next software before I do that just because we have it brightened up over there and I've got things just a little more sharpened um, on that end where the heck is the other hmm where's my other picture where is my other picture let's see strange hmm Oh, here it is. Okay. Okay, now see this one, I th yeah, this one might be a little sharper I don't know that okay and they look the same because they're all in the same area it's just different frames okay um 
let me go to here let's do this one let's put this over that just so y'all can see again okay and what I mean by face to face okay if you stand if you stand face to face to someone okay and if your your chest is close to theirs all right I think somebody kind of referred it to like the tango tango dance I guess that's where you I'm pretty sure that's what it is let me pull let me just let's pull it up let's look okay because y'all not really too um you know whatever on the tango but I think I'm I think I'm I think I know what that is. I think that's when you're standing close to someone and you're, yes, just like this. Yep, that's exactly right. Yes, you're standing chest to chest with someone, okay? And when you're walking forward with them, like you're using your your right leg and the other person's using their left leg. You know what I'm saying? So it's like you have, you have two... You have two different legs, okay? Yeah, there's a right leg and a left leg, but they're coming from two different people. You see what I'm saying? That is exactly how I am seeing what is going on in these pictures, okay? It's like, and then in between them, they have a person. They have a person, okay? They're carrying someone, just like how I just showed y'all how they're swinging the child. Um, that's what I see. Uh, as a matter of fact, let's go back to that picture. Okay, just so we can refer back to that. Because I will show y'all that again in just a second. All right. We're going to go down and we're going to, um, I'm going to do some outlining and we're going to go to the other software and look at these pictures. See, I can't even find that. I can't even find the picture of them swinging that kid now. Okay. But it's like where you have their your hands underneath the child's chest and you're swinging them. I mean, yeah, you're swinging them like they're flying, like they have their arms out. Okay. And if y'all, right here. Okay, it's going to be just like this. All right, so let's go to this right here. All right, so let's look. This is the... Hold on, y'all. I have to check my air conditioner. Hold on one second. Okay, sorry about that. My AC has been kicking on and off and all this crap. It's just it's way too hot outside, and I am probably need a new unit. But anyways, besides all that, let's into this. Okay, I need this little bar up here. So I can outline. Okay. I'm sorry, y'all. I know this is a mess right here. Not really too organized with this video, and I apologize. But, y'all, this is something that I've been just sitting here looking at for the last couple days. And if I don't put it out now... I'm not going to because, like I said, I will sit there and I will keep doubting myself. And then I'm going to get overwhelmed. And then I'm going to get discouraged, okay? That's just how it is sometimes. All right? So, let me just... Let me put this block back over this, okay? Because I'm going to explain to y'all what I see. All right? It looks to me like someone is standing right here, Okay? They're facing this person. It looks to me like this like this white thing right here. Okay, I don't know if this is just something that was edited in. All right, because there were a lot of things that were edited in. This is but that white part is supposed to be Kanika's chest and I don't know, maybe her bra, but it's supposed to be her chest. It's supposed to be the light reflecting off of her chest, okay? Which looks nothing like what it's supposed to be okay but when we put this block over when i put this square over them all right it, that's when it, it looks it literally looks like two people facing each other all right now remember how i explained with the feet okay the feet could be turned 
in this direction, or they could be facing each other. This white piece right here looks very edited too, which is supposed to be Kanika's shoe, all right? And we all know Kanika did not have white shoes on. She had gray shoes on. Yeah, they were light gray, but they're not going to be, they're not going to look white, okay? But this white piece right here looks to me like somebody's arm, all right? Maybe I'm wrong on that, okay? I don't know. That might not even be somebody's arm, but that's what it looks like it could be to me. So let me get, let me get this, and I'm going to draw, let's see here. Okay, I'm going to draw what I see real quick. Let's do, let's see here. I'm sorry, because all this stuff, but you know, on this type of software right here that I have, if I, if I put, let me see here, if I um put it on full screen, I don't know how to write on it. I don't know how to draw on it, okay? So, I mean, I'm sure there there's probably a way, but... Y'all, I don't know how to work. I don't know how to work a lot of the software that I have, okay? Like, I have a freaking memory problem, and it's like, whatever I know how to do is just, that's how it's got to get done, because, what the heck I'm doing sometimes? Like, what is this? Let's see what paint is. Maybe that's something where I can draw on it in, while it's in full screen mode. Let's check and see, because if I can, it'll make it a lot easier for me. And maybe even y'all, okay? Let's see. No, that's not it. Okay. So we're not going to do that then. Let me take that off. That's just to give it some more color and stuff. And I'm not... I'm not doing that right now. Okay. Let's go back to this. Let me pull my little uh, marker up. Let's get this up here. I hope y'all can see this just fine. Um, dang. Okay. I'm actually going to... You know what? Let me do this on a bigger picture. I'm so sorry, y'all. I, I really feel bad about this. Hold on. It's just I try to make it... I try to make things a little easier for me. You know, me and y'all. Okay. Not the best one that I can see. That's number one. That's two. This one is three. Let's see. One, two. Okay, here, we'll just do this one. Okay, and like, look. Alright. Okay, if y'all. If y'all don't see two people standing in there, do this. Put um, put your thumb, all right? And you don't have to touch the screen. Just put your thumb over your device, over the face, just like this. You should see two people standing right there. Looks like they're chest to chest. Like I said, it looks like this is an arm right here, okay? But here, I'm going to go ahead and zoom in. And then we'll get to drawing, okay? I'm actually, I'm actually zoom in just like that. Just so that way we already have that. And you can just kind of see. Well, no, I'm not going to do that. Here, we'll just do like this. Okay, let's get this marker out. I don't like doing, I shouldn't do with blue on here. I did it with blue to do Kanika the other day, and I, after watching the video, I'm like, wow, you can't even really see the color too good. Okay, so, all right, and excuse me while I, um, do this, y'all, y'all might hear a little bit of noise, it is my finger rubbing across my, my touchpad on my computer, so if it gets a little loud, I do apologize, 
It won't be real loud, but it'll be some noise, okay? So, okay, this is the other person I see standing over here, okay? And you know, and it's very possible, okay? It's very possible. See how they have their arm up? You know, it looks like they could be putting their arm possibly under Kanika's arm. Like, I feel like these are her arms right here hanging down. This is her head. You know what I'm saying? Like, this is, this is what I see, okay? Okay, so somebody's head, somebody else's head is over here. Okay, now this part right here that looks like a mask or whatever is supposed to be Kanika's face. All right, I don't, do not believe that's Kanika's face. Does it look anything like her or none of that? Okay, um, I, I feel like this is maybe something over someone's face or maybe it's an image. Um, you know, it could be whatever, but this person could have their face up, okay, because a lot of people are like, oh, well, you know, her hair, you know, it looks like a wig. Yes, it does look like a wig, um, and it's very possible that, you know, that they had a, a wig or something over them to look to, to play as Kanika's wig, okay? Maybe they needed something to look like Kanika's hair for the footage, okay? Um... I hope y'all are following me. You know, it's it's a lot, and I just it's hard to, it's hard to explain all of this. Okay. The thing is, this person, you know, we keep seeing like arms going up, or sometimes you see things that are like hidden. It looks like hair. It makes me wonder. You know, did they have her wig? Or well, she didn't have a wig, but did they have the wig? covering their face, you know, trying to cover their faces, um, I don't know, okay, I don't know, like I said, there could be multiple reasons why an arm could be up, like, this would be the elbow, this would be the hand, and this is the person's forearm, you know what I'm saying, like, they're holding, if they're holding Kanika in that swinging motion, then their arms could be up holding her arms, you see what I'm saying? Like, their elbows, her arms are going over their elbow. Alright, so let me outline this person. I'm so sorry it's taken me so long to get to this part, but I just, I needed to, ex feel like I need to explain, um, you know, I need to explain what's going on. It's not even that I feel like I need to, because... I ain't gonna just throw a video out here without, you know, with just some pictures being shown. Because then people will be like, what are you trying to show me? <laughs> like, I don't see nothing. Okay, so here's someone else's leg. Okay, this is another person's leg. So this is another person over here. There's a person right here. Now, this is what, to me, I think is Kanika. Okay, I think this is one of her arms. Right here, hanging down. I think this is her hair. Her head. Okay. Which also... And this is this is something over here hanging down. And I believe this is her other arm. Because in other pictures, you can see... Let me just zoom out a little bit. You can see where her arms are hanging down. Okay, I know this is a terrible drawing. I hope y'all get the gist of what I'm trying to explain here. Oh, let me turn this off. I really hope y'all understand what I'm trying to explain. Um, like I said, it is difficult. It's very difficult to explain. All right, because like I keep saying, it's not your average. Um, you know, this is not your average case. This is not your average situation. So, you know, it's going, it's, it's hard to explain something that's not, it that just seems, you know, that is weird to all of us. You know, it's, it's strange because it's a cover-up. So, oh, let me get this off. Take that off. Okay, so I need to get, let me pull another picture up real quick. Um, 
just so I can give y'all an example of her arm hanging down. Okay, what I'm talking about. Right here. Okay, so let me do this one. What is this? Number three. Okay, so let me pull this one up and let me draw on that one. Just so maybe I can explain it a little better. What is up with all of this? Okay. Oh, here's three. It's not res. Let's see. Okay, let me get... Okay, right here. Okay, so let me let me outline this one just to show y'all real quick. Okay, because I'm, I'm not going to be on here too much longer. I feel like I'm probably confusing y'all a little more than anything. I hope and pray to God that I'm not. Okay, like I said, all right, this is what I see. Let me take that off. Let's move this. Let me zoom in a little bit. Let me just put this over that, okay? Okay, the same colors. Okay, so like I said, I see someone. Right? Why isn't this? Hmm. Oh, here we go. So like I said, these are the, all these are basically the same picture. Um, they look sort of the same. So a few things are just a little bit different, slightly different because different frames. Okay. Um, but see, like this right here, like I said, looks like somebody's arm. You know what I'm saying? Like if you pull your, like if you make a fist, you know, if you go to, you know, show your muscles. Okay. Or if you're holding, if you're holding something in your elbow, like a bag or a person or whatever, you're going to have your arm bent up, okay, which gives it this shape. You see what I'm saying? Like the elbow, the forearm, the wrist, the hand, okay? I could be wrong, but this is how I perceive it, all right? This is how I'm, this is how I look at it. Like, I can't, can't help it. This is how, this is exactly what I see when I look at these pictures. Um, like I said, their head would be you know, like over here, okay, um, you know, this could be part of the wig, this could be part of the person's hair, I don't really know, um, but I know for a fact, though, that I definitely, without a doubt, I see two people, I, I clearly, in those other pictures, I can clearly see someone's face right here, okay, you know, I see, I see their arm going like this, Okay, this is how I see their arm. I don't see their arm going down. I clearly see their arm going just like this. Alright, like they're holding her arm up. Alright, so let me, oh, let me finish outlining this person. Okay, just so you can sort of, okay. All right, now we'll do Kanika back in yellow. Okay, okay, what I wanted to explain, okay, when I said that this is, to me, it looks like her head or her hair, okay, and that, that concerns me a little, okay? See, this looks like her arms, and y'all, that means her feet would be in the back, in the back part right here, okay, which are edited out. We don't see them, okay? Possibly, there's someone behind them carrying her feet okay I don't know but I know in that other picture when they were walking up against this wall right here in the other video that foot that was dragging behind did not look like someone that was carrying her it looked like their foot was being dragged not walking um you know which which is fine I mean all through the hotel they have changed their position on carrying her so those of you that are just popping in, 
Like I said, this is a terrible diagram, okay? But to me, it looks like there's two people holding Kanika in this position. Oh, right here. Okay, it looks like they're holding her in this swinging position like this. Okay, like they're carrying her. Except their hands aren't really on her chest in this, from what I see. It looks like their arms are up under her arms. Okay, and that's why we see her arms dangling on the sides a lot. Okay, it's because of how she's being picked up under her arms. Whether she's being drugged, whether she's being held like this. Um, whatever the case is, we always see her arms in a dangling motion. Um, it's never, you know, it's never down by her side because she's not walking. She is being carried. Okay. Now, see, whenever I pull this off, this is supposed to be Kanika's face. Okay. Let me, let me remove all this real quick. See, we'll clear that off. Okay. Let's see. I have another picture that I want to show y'all. Okay. It goes with all of this. It is a fourth picture I'm going to bring into this. If I can pull it up. What's going on? Oh, I don't know what is going on. Um. Oh. Sorry, y'all. I'm having a. It's hot in here. It's very hot in this house. <laughs> like, I don't know what's going on with my air. Okay. So I want to show y'all this right here. Okay, because it's sort of the same. It's the. It's in the same hall, and it's it's a it's quite a few it's a few frames up from the ones that I just showed y'all. Okay, um, but this is it's a very we're all familiar with this picture. Okay, it's literally when her her head. Okay, what well, they want us to think that her head just went all the way back like that, and her neck extended. Okay. We know that is not going to happen, all right? Who walks like this, okay, intoxicated or not? You know what I'm saying? Like, that right there does not look right, right? And I think we've all come to agree. <coughs> Excuse me, y'all. I'm so sorry. Like I said, it's hot in here. I got asthma. I can't breathe. So, anyways... We've all, we've all come to agree that this right here never looked right to us, to any of us. It just always looked strange. And this right here is strictly a screenshot from the footage, okay, from Rosemont. All right, so I have not put this through software, not in this picture. This one that I'm showing you right now is not through software, all right? This is supposed to be her face in the air. She's literally supposed to have her face up to the air, neck extended out, and walking. But when you look at the video, her neck literally kind of grows in the in the footage okay so we know that's impossible okay so like i said okay we all know that that is impossible to do okay i mean just people don't walk like that from what we've seen kanika did not act then she didn't act like any of this that we see her in the hallway she didn't have these actions on a regular basis. Um, she didn't walk like this. And we know this because we saw plenty of live videos with her. Okay. And she did not, you know, she did, she didn't present herself like any of this that we see in the footage. Okay. So let me just show you real quick after I put it through this software, okay? And then after this, I'm going to end the video, okay? So I'm just giving y'all a heads up. I will be ending in just a minute. I just want to show y'all this um, because, once again, it just, it shows. You know, there's multiple people there, um, and it just... There's no way she was alone. 
you know, and it's like, I mean, we, yeah, we know she wasn't alone, but you know, y'all, by going through all these pictures and stuff, like we are, a lot of answers are going to start coming out. Watch. A whole lot. Okay. If this is too close, just put your device back. Um, okay, but I mean, even here. Right here. Now, this is her neck. Okay, this is supposed to be Kanika's neck. This is supposed to be her arms and stuff hanging down. Yeah, I believe it's her arms, um, but not because she's standing. Once again, because she's being carried. Oh, real quick. I, I never explained what I was talking about with her hair. Like I said, okay, we all, well, from what we saw and from what we were told, okay, Kanika was supposed to have long hair. Okay, long, straight hair. Okay, she was supposed to have long, straight, pretty weave in her head. Okay, now right here, like I said, this looks like, to me, it looks like they're carrying her. We don't see the long, straight hair. We don't see long hair at all. Okay, the thing is, what makes me, what makes me wonder, okay, because we saw how her hair looked in the freezer. Okay, and this is, I'm just putting a thought out there. Just simply just putting a thought out into the world. Okay, a possibility. All right, we've all been through the possibility that, you know, maybe they cut her hair. Her hair was cut. You know, we see that her hair is a mess in the freezer. Okay. But they want to show us, though, that her hair looked fine and straight and intact walking through the hallway. But she gets in the freezer and all of a sudden it's a wreck, it's a mess, it's all over the place. Alright? Now, it just makes me wonder, you know, I mean, like I said, this could be her right here being carried in that swinging position. Um, just like this. Just like this. Okay? Maybe they cut her hair. Maybe they did cut her hair. Um... You know, does anybody know for a fact, did she have weave in her hair? Okay, that is what I really, really, really want to know. Was that really weave in her hair or did she have a wig on? Okay, um, you know, that's, that's a question that we really need the answer to. Um, because right here, I don't see the long hair. And it just, you know, maybe they had her hair pulled back. You know, to hide from hanging down and all of that. Possibly, they cut it. Like, we don't know what happened to her throughout the night. We don't know. Um, but, I mean, if you look right here, you you can see people's faces right here. Hold on, give me one second, y'all. Let me just pause this one more time. Okay, sorry about that. Uh, the air went out again, y'all. Like I said, it's about 100 degrees outside, and it's about 80 in here. Okay, so anyways, like I was saying... You know, it just makes me wonder why, because, I mean, I clearly see her being carried in that swinging type position, okay? Um, you know, just what happened to her hair? You know, it's just, it just, it really bothers me because, like I say all the time, we don't really know and we'll never know what she went through that night, you know, and it's, I mean, it's a good thing, sort of, that we won't know, you know what I'm saying, because you got to put yourself in a parent's position, you know, yes, you always want to know what happened to your child, you know, but some of the details can be spared, you know, it's like, you want to know everything, but then again, it's like, you really don't, you really don't want to know. And yeah, we weren't Kanika's parents, okay? But I put myself in a parent's position because I'm a, I'm a mother. I have four kids, you know? Kanika had a mother, okay? And, um, you know, it's just, you know, no parent needs to go through the, the gory details of every single thing that happened to their child, you know, and, um, but I mean, we'll never know everything that happened to her, you know, and God only knows 
what went down in Crown Plaza that night. You know what I'm saying? Like, I mean, we're only going to know what we can see from footage, okay? And possibly through some live videos, you know, if the, if the real, if the actual videos ever surface, then yeah, then we might have, you know, a whole lot more answers. Um, you know, but who knows if that'll ever happen. You know what I'm saying? And it's like, that. this is all we have to go by is footage, surveillance footage, and live videos. You know what I'm saying? Like, we don't really have people, we don't have people talking and running their mouths and stuff like that. You know what I'm saying? Like, we're not hearing what people have to say about what happened or anything like that. People are scared to talk. You know, they're very scared to talk. And if, if y'all don't believe that, then, you know, you really might want to do some extra thinking because people are getting killed left and right. And that's how it's been ever since Kanika died. Ever since Kanika was killed, so many people from that party have died. It's just a matter of time before they're all gone. And, you know, I mean, there's a reason why. There's a reason why they're dying. Either because they were involved, you know, or or whoever killed her is scared that they're going to start running their mouths, you know. So, it's, you know, either way, it's people from this party that are, there are people that are connected to her, to her that are getting killed, you know, and getting shot at and everything else. You know, there's a reason why. Okay. But, um... Like I said, I mean, if you look in what is supposed to be her neck, okay, let me just, let me just cover her face, okay, for, well, what, what is supposed to be her right here, okay, let me just cover that, and you can clearly see people right here. If you look over here, even a little clearer than the other picture, sort of, okay, it's not a, um, you know, like crystal clear type thing, you know, picture or whatever. But it is what the heck is going on? Okay, but it is um oh shoot. I hope I didn't mess anything up. I hope I didn't zoom into anything for you. I don't know what the hell. Damn. Crap. Dang, I hope I didn't mess nothing up. I don't know if y'all can see what, what all that is. Anyways, the thing is right there, you can see someone right here you can see, clearly see someone right there you know what i'm saying like you can see you can sort of even see facial features a little bit you know and it's like if i didn't know better well i can't even really say i know better yeah. You know, it makes me wonder, like, is that Ty? You know what I'm saying? It's looked like Ty, you know, in a couple different areas. Maybe it's not. It might not be. But it sure does look like it a little bit, you know. But I'm not going to start saying that that's who it is because I don't know. I'm just saying that the person sort of resembles resembles him or maybe like the head shape or something like that. Um but I'm not going to get too involved on Ty because I do have other pictures where I have other faces and they're not Ty's. Okay. But that'll be for a different time. Um, but yeah, I mean, as you can see, though, you see two faces right here. And I swear, y'all, it looks like they are holding this baby. Like, it looks like they are holding her. Like her, like she is face down. Like it's, that's what it looks like to me. It looks like Kanika would be face down. Like they're holding her under her arms. You know, and they're carrying her. It just breaks my heart so bad, y'all. You know, it's like, what do, what do we do? You know? So many people ask all the time, you know, you know, about the FBI. Do you know how much stuff we've sent to the FBI? Do you have any, does anybody have any clue how much stuff has been sent to the FBI? 
especially when Kanika first got killed, like everybody was sending stuff to the FBI. Everybody was calling the FBI. We were doing everything that we could to get the FBI to step in. Did they? No. Okay. No, they didn't. And the thing is, it's like this, okay? The case needs national attention for the FBI to try to step in and reopen this case. And you see what I'm saying? Like, this is a major cover-up, y'all. Okay, if I were to just send stuff into the FBI and say, hey, you know, can you please open this case? This is everything that I found. Um, first of all, with this being a cover-up, I'm putting myself in danger, okay? Because I'm, I'm giving them my information or how to track me or whatever, okay? You know what I'm saying? And I'm literally giving them you know, like, I'm I'm letting them know everything, okay? But the thing is, not even just that. If you have one person going or even, like, 20 people sending in stuff to the FBI and saying, hey, can you open this up? You know, this is what it is. With it being a cover-up, they're going to overlook that. But if, it's a, if, it is, if this case is brought back and given the national attention that this case deserves, that Kanika deserves... It will get reopened. They won't have a choice but to reopen it because it will blow back up out the water like it did when she first died. You know, and that is what we need. We don't need this case to die down. We don't need it to become, to continue on as a closed case, shut, op open, shut, closed type deal. We don't need that. No. We need this case to be opened back up, but we need it to be bigger than what it, what it was when it first happened. Because when Kanika first died, yeah, it, it sparked attention all over the world, okay? But it died, the case died very quickly. Not with us, but with a lot of other people. They were just like, oh, well, they said it was, they said it was an accident. How sad, you know? And they move on with their lives, okay? A lot of people have forgotten about Kanika. A lot of people feel like it was an accident. But that's not what it was. You know, it was nowhere near an accident. Um, this, was a, this was a murder. And this case deserves all the attention in the world. She deserves to get attention just like everything else that's going on. You know, I just don't understand how all these protests are going on, okay, for all of this stuff. You've got Black Lives Matter. You've got, you know, people protesting for every single person that died and got killed by police, okay? What about Kanika? What about Kanika? Is she going to be brought up in any of these protests? And yeah, it's easy for some of y'all to say, oh, well, if you want to protest for it, and God, why aren't you doing it? Hello? Just because I'm not out in the world around all these sick people and, and out here protesting at the protest, you know, in person, does not mean that I'm not protesting, okay? Everything that I'm doing right now is protesting, okay? It's just a different type of protesting. It's a different way. Okay, I don't want to show my face. I don't want to put myself in harm's way. I don't need to be out there. I don't need to um, be around all the sickness. But the people that are out there around all the sickness and everything else and who don't, who aren't worried about it, say Kanika's name. Let's bring this case back open, y'all. It needs to open back up. Share this video out. Share all these videos out, okay? Everybody's videos. It don't even matter. It needs to be reopened. She deserves to get the attention of everybody in the world again, okay? Like, we really, really need this. Her family need this. Kanika deserves this more than anybody else. More than the fact that 
we need answers or that we want answers. More than the fact that her mother needs to be able to have an answer. More than, you know, the rest of her family. Kanika deserves this more than anybody else. You know, this child went through hell that night. She went through pure hell. And I don't care what she did to quote unquote get killed, okay? Because there's nothing that she could have done that deserved her to die. You know, there's there's nothing that she could have done to deserve that. So, you know, her story needs to be heard. And it needs to be continuously heard until it is reopened. Just like Kendrick Johnson's Everybody Else's. I just don't understand why Kanika isn't talked about. I don't understand why Kanika has been forgotten over the last three years. You know? And that was a promise that I made when I first got on this case. I will not stop until answers are brought, until answers are brought out, until we have answers, until she gets justice. I will not stop. I won't stop. You know, so this is a commitment that I've made, not only to myself, but to Kanika, you know, to her family. Okay. I mean, this is something that I have, I have specifically, I'm sure, I believe, I'm pretty sure I've told her mom, you know, I will not stop until, until we find out what happened to her daughter. Okay. And if I have not specifically told her mother, I've told people close to the family. Okay. You know, so this is something that I cannot stop doing. You know, Kanika deserves this. Her family deserves this. And this case needs to be brought back open immediately. You know, I mean, this is not an accident. An accident does not show multiple people carrying her through the hallway. I have run the software over random pictures before, okay? That aren't Kanika or aren't friends or aren't people in the hotel. I have run the software over over random images, over random people, and all this stuff does not come up. I have put, you know, these squares... This square, like these bars right here, magnifying bars, the over people, over random pictures of random people. And I don't see two people walking, carrying a body. I don't see that. You only see these things in this footage. And you only see a lot of these things with Kanika. And that's because it was edited. So anybody that doesn't believe that, I don't know what to tell you. I have no clue what to tell you. But that's what it is. It's all edited. All right. So, like I said, I'm going to get off of here, y'all. I cannot believe I've been on here for an hour. Um, y'all, just leave your comments and feedback below. Let me know if y'all see what I pointed out. Um, you know, like I said, I'm sorry for... I apologize for rambling on sometimes. Like I said, sometimes I get a little... I get a little overwhelmed, okay, because, like I've said before, it's hard to explain this. How the heck do you explain this? You know what I'm saying? How do you explain this? How do you explain the fact that inside of what is supposed to be one person, there's three people? You know what I'm saying? Like, it's absurd. And, and that is what makes things seem so unbelievable. But that's because it's not... Because it's not the norm. Like, this is not something that we're used to dealing with. Well, we're used to dealing with it, but a lot of people aren't used to dealing with. You know, it's not your average situation. Um, and the only reason that I'm used to it is because because of the Kanika case. You know what I'm saying? This is something I've never, I've never seen in my life besides this. You know, and it just absolutely disgusts me that this freaking hotel is still open they're still operating, and they still have guests coming in and staying and spending the night. Um, it's just sick to me. You know, and it's sick to me that anybody would even go through the trouble to edit someone's murder. You know? It, it just... I, I just don't get it. But 
I don't want to understand it because I don't ever want to be, I don't ever want to have to understand why somebody would do that, you know, because I don't have that type of mind. So, y'all, leave your comments, leave your feedback, let me know what y'all see. Like I always tell y'all, if you see something different or see something in a different way or see something that I have not pointed out, please do not be afraid to let me know. Um, if you don't want to leave a comment under the video, feel free to contact me through email or you can contact me through Facebook. The links for all that is down below. If you have not subscribed to my other channel, click on the link to that down below. Subscribe. Don't forget to hit the notification bell. If you haven't subscribed to this channel that you're on, hit that subscribe button, what you're waiting on, and do not forget to hit that notification bell because... When I go live or when I put up a video, you will want to see it. So, with that being said, y'all, I am out of here. I love y'all. Y'all stay safe. God bless y'all. Don't forget to wear those masks and keep those hands sanitized. We need the spread to go down. I love y'all. Have a wonderful day. Talk to y'all later. Toodles.